Oh, we're back here again with another one of these, and guess what? I got some more Fusion Force! I opened the box before earlier on my channel, you can go back and check out that video, but for now, we managed to get a hold of some of these collector's editions that were popping up in stores re uh, recently. Although, the thing is, when I ordered these online, uh, they gave me two of the uh, Fangzor X Mantanoid ones, and I didn't get the Gilator X Pegatrix one, so unfortunate. Nah, I'll get the Pegasus at Kyoto one later, but for now, we don't care about the, the jumbo cars, nobody cares about that. We care about the packs! The packs that come along with these, the fabled Fusion Force cards that can only be found in Mythical Legends! We finally have some more Fusion Force. Oh, and I know that uh, there's a box of Fusion Force that was found before, and I did find it. However, Kimbo uh, managed to buy it. I did, I did tell Kimbo that, uh, where to find that box of Fusion Force, and he just instantly went and bought it. So uh, he can thank me for that. So, uh, but for now, at least we got some more Fusion Force cards. Uh, got nine chances of uh, pulling maybe a Darkest Shadow. The hunt for Darkest Shadow continues. Let's go. So, I managed to get them all open, I can throw those in the garbage, and uh, just so I can show you guys the jumbo cards and stuff, uh, we got like jumbo cards of the fusions, character cards, in their like uh, base, uh, basic state, like what, uh, like what they begin at the beginning of the game with, uh, but for some reason, uh, the fusion side is not, does not show up in the jumbo, it's the standard character card uh, side, uh, so yeah, that kind of... That kind of solves the mystery of whether or not these are legal in the game. They're probably not. Not if uh, the fusion cards do not have the fusion side uh, printed on the jumbos, so that can go away. Uh, since I got two Fangzorx Mantanoid uh, boxes, uh, I get uh, I get these two of these. So yeah, but uh, these deck boxes designs okay, uh, but I don't. But these things, they don't hold. Uh, sleeved cards with Bakugan. I see these as only holding 40 uh, unsleeved cards and 3 Bakugan. That's about it. Yeah, they're just like really small. Main event time! 9 packs! Let's see if we pull Darkest Shadow. Alright, so we got our packs here. I'm really excited honestly. I haven't opened packs in like forever. So uh, yeah, let's hope we pull Darkest Shadow or at least some goodies that uh, people want. So yeah, I am sat very awkwardly so you'll have to bear with me. All right, let's see what we got. Uh, Darkest Dodge, Battle Hardened, Chaotic Fury Charge, okay, Meteor Sting, Haya Scorch, Pyra Field, Ventus Vision, each player reveals top card of their deck. If there's cost the most, draw it. Oh, cool. Swampagon, that's good. Yes! 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 <laughs> Boom shakalaka! We got Darkest Shadow! Yes! First pack! We get Darkest Shadow! Oh my god, the hunt is over! Darkest Shadow for the win! That is going in my deck! Uh, that's, so yeah! Video is over! We got Darkest Shadow, so these packs don't matter anymore! No, I'm kidding, we'll open the rest. But yes! Darkest Shadow! We got it! So that's cool. A Hex Aquatonic Payload, and uh... Pyrus Feral for uh, the epic character card. Only comes with like a reroll ability, so <laughs> so whatever. Oh my god, I think I'm gonna lose my voice. But yeah, I, I can't believe we pulled Darkest Shadow. Like, oh my god, it is absolutely beautiful! Choose one! Pyrus, Darkest, Chaos, Pyrus, uh, Aquos, or Ventus. Your opponent reveals their hand and discards all the cards chosen in the faction. Anti-Mono! Oh my god, and only a four cost. Alright, let's see what else we get, because I already got my uh, Phil Baku Fuser, Hail Smasher, Thermal Baku Fusion Power, Couple Clones, Aerial Quake, Mossified Couple Beam, Hyper Pyrus, that's really cool, Trox X Cyrus uh, for Diamond, and Baku Gear Warrior. Uh, it's a three cost, plus seven. Draw two for each Bakugan attached to that Bakugan. A potential plus four, okay. And Hex Teratomic Overdrive. Uh, three cost, plus 100 B power for each energy card you have in play. Boost, plus one for each energy card you have in play. Yeah, this is a, this is a pretty decent card. Uh, so, 
Yep, for a good energy ramp. And we got Ventus Feral this time for an epic character card. Last time we had Pyrus Feral, now we got Ventus. That's pretty neat. But, oh my god, Darker Shadow, I still can't get over it. Now I just need Kimbo's uh, two Hex Darker Shadows, and then I'll be set. Alright, what do we got? Uh, we got Pyrus Spirit, Pyrus Magma Fist, Baku Spin Blast, Dark Resilience, the live action uh, picture. Dark Disaster, Darkest Fist, Pyrus Ascendancy, Diamond Dragonoid X Treadorous, Ventus Football, but, uh, that came in the starter decks, so it's not really anything that special. But uh, four cost put Bakugan from an enemy Bakugan into one of your open Bakugan. And for a hex, we got a Darkest Titan Gilator Ultra, four cost. Victor, each opposing player discards a card for each Bakugan attached to this. So potential discard two. It's uh, 1000 B power and three damage. It's cool. We'll put these over there. And Aquas Nilius for an uh, epic character card. Okay. Now, if only the epic character cards would actually be really cool if they released the packs and cards more consistently. Maybe that maybe that way Spin Master will actually make up make uh, enough money as expected from their quarterly earnings report if they actually release the cards. Okay, Darkest Slayer, Py uh, Pyro's Energizer, Ventus Tornado, Baku Spring, Sophie, Aqua Burst, Diamond Dragon Art Treasures again. Diamond Dragon Ultra, that's really cool. Lightning Pack Leader. Uh, so your Baku, your Aquas and Darkest Bakugan have Victor draw two. Cool. And a diamond version of Troxac Cyrus. That's soft. that's uh, looking cool. Oh yeah, we got uh, Pegatrix Ultra for the epic character card. So let's see what's next. Uh, Baku Spring, Halo Slasher, Darkest Destroyer, Halo Energizer, Pyro's Energizer, Ventus Tornado, Swamp Bugon, Ventus Vision, another Lightning Pack Leader again, and a Auralist Hyper Pegatrix for a Hex. Four costs, 1106. When you play this, you may return a Bakugir from the Discord pile to hand. Okay, so it recycles Bakugir. And oh, hey, Aqua's uh, Nilius Ultra for the epic character card. I think I know someone that wants this, but uh, I'm not sure if they if they got it or not. I keep the epic, epic character cards, so, uh, so yeah, if uh, people are looking for specific ones, maybe I might have it. Okay, we got Ventus Piercer. Ah, I'm getting a little full. Baku Cavalry, uh, Bakugan's new trick, 5 cost, uh, draw 3. Aqua Soldier, Washed Away, Aqua Slash, Halkar Ultra. Oh, Diamond Hydras, uh, Eevee wants that. Uh, Pyrus Hyper Patrix Ultra. Cool, that came in a starter deck. Uh, a Hex version of Bakugan Warrior, we already saw that, but a Hex version is always really cool. And, uh, Hulk Aqua's Halkar Ultra. Uh, when you attach a Bakugan to this, uh, draw one. They, I think they errata, uh, this, uh, deck build. Nothing too special. That was just a... Yep. Alright. Battle Hardened. Chaotic Fury Charge, Chaos Scorch, Falling Strike, Sync Card, Rune, uh, Runus Blade, uh, Payload. Oh, Feral Strike! Cool! Uh, one cost, you can only play this on Auralist Bakugan. Uh, it's a two, plus 200 plus 2 permanently, so it's no wonder that it's cost 1 to play. Oh, a Hex Howling Shell Bomb! Damn! This is like a really good card, and uh, like it's one of the actual sync cards that is needed. And I got a Hex version of it, that's awesome! And uh, Auralus Nilius Ultra, while this is Baku, while Baku Gear is attached to this, uh, plus 5. Uh, cool for the other card, sorry. Wow, we are got we got some really good pulls uh, for a collectors for collectors editions. But man, if I only bought that one collectors edition, I would have gotten the darker shadow right away. That's pretty awesome. Aqua Soldier, Aerial Quake, Mox White Cobble Beam, Washed Away, Venti Piercer, Braku Briar, <laughs> Briar, uh, Hyper Pyrus, Truxex Cyrus, another darkest shadow. God damn, that's two. Wow, I would have worn it as in Hex, but you know what? I'll take it! Two Darkest Shadows down! Uh, Titan Enoch Ultra for Auralis. But, uh, and it's in Hex. 5 cost, 1210. When this opens, swap Baku Course with opposing Bakugan. So it's not bad in a uh, Chaos deck. Uh, but in Hex form, oh man, it's shiny. It's super shiny. And Ventus Nilius, uh, you may reroll this once per turn. You may, oh, reroll. All right, last pack. Let's see. Uh, let's see if we can get two dark, three darkest shadows. Maybe one will be in hex. Let's uh, let's see what we catch here. But let me know in the comments down below if you want to see me open more of these uh, things. I'm hoping the uh, I'm hoping maybe Shields of Australia is gonna have uh, these things released. 
Everett Ray, Pyrus Energizer, Pyrus Stormer, McEwen Cycloid. Uh, it's one of those like generic uh, hero things where like if you team attack, it goes back to your hand. Back to back, head to shred, Trox Xyrus, Trox, summon Baku Gear. For the rest of the turn, you may play Baku Gear cards for free for a 7 cost. 7 cost is like really high, so it's like, it's you. It's not guaranteed you're gonna get it off. And we got a Hex Baku Treasure! Damn! That's uh, that's one of the good, that's another one of the good ones. So really great pulls and Aqua's Alicor for the Epic Character card. But my god! Well, look what we got. Two Darkest Shadows. The hunt for Darkest Shadow is over. We got two of them when I only wanted one, but we, two of them is really good. So yeah, the hunt's over. We got Darkest Shadow and I'm super hyped. I'm going to put it immediately in my deck. And then for uh, the other shinies and stuff, we got Baku Treasure, Summon Baku Gear. Howling Shell Bomb is a really big money one, I think. Barrel Strike is another good one that Chad might use. Uh, two Lightning Pack Leaders. And uh, some very decent staples for Hex. Uh, but uh, yeah, that's all we got. I can't believe we got two Darkest Shadows. Two, uh, two Darkest Shadows, mission accomplished. Uh, these Collector's Edition really came through and on my first try too. But yeah, that was my opening. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Subscribe to Baku Talk for more awesome Bakugan content. I've been Haru Ren. Thank God for Rapid Fire. And thank God for Darkest Shadows. Bye.